Hello, my wonderful collective. This is the highest energy going on right now with the collective. What do we need to know the most? What is going on? What do we need to know the most? What do we need to protect ourselves from? What do we need to look out for? Why am I getting sneaky people? Sne reconciliation. Be careful with who you connect, reconnect with again. Reconciliation. Make sure y'all are on the same page. Make sure you want the same things as individuals in order to be a better couple. Make sure no one is coming into the situation to use anyone. Make sure you can sustain yourself on your own and you don't need anyone for anything, for that validation or for need or for codependency. Reconciliation. Because guess what? The same thing is going to repeat. What else we need to know? What else we need to know the most? Truth. Make sure you are prepared to see the truth. You're going to feel the truth inside anyway. That's how you know something is cautioning you. A red flag. You know it to be true. You don't know how you know it to be true. But this stems from within. Whoever these people are will be reflecting something to you that you will not be able to deny. See it for what it is. Make sure you don't have the same problems. Truth be told. Be okay with the truth. What you hear, what you know. Otherwise, you will set yourself up. Prosperity. Something about heritage. You have a strong heritage amongst the spiritual community. Heavily gifted amongst the spiritual community. Maybe your ancestor was co connected to uh, um, witches. Somebody who they claim was a witch, but had gifts passed down from each legacy. These people are gifted. We all come with different gifts of the spiritual nature handed by your higher power. Don't let hateful people who don't have those spiritual gifts make you think that it's demonic. Where did we come from? What source? How did we get here? If that is the case, we are all demonic. We are a gift from somewhere, from something. And we are able to gift other things into our life like children. The body is a gift and it does a lot of things that they still haven't understood yet. The ocean comes with so many things that they still haven't discovered yet. Stop trying to make, let people make you think that everything about you is demonic because of the way they think of demonic, not good people. Sinful people, liars, deceivers, they want you to be in confusion, living in confusion, contradicting yourself like them. Reflection, know the truth of your existence. Be okay with that. We, we come from a long line of descendants that are gifted. Prosperity. When you accept yourself for who you are, you will be receiving prosperity on different levels, not just money. Not just money, peace, comfortability, moving, serenity within, completion, relationships getting better, loving connections that are true, understanding and knowing things that you never knew you knew, but it's always been subconscious. It will come to the conscious mind so you can understand it. Bottom of the deck, talented, gifted. Serene. People see you as gifted, talented, serene, multi-talented. Be okay with that. Continue to master those gifts. Continue to be free within those gifts, within that purpose. It is you. You are it. It will continue to make you even more authentic. The answers will always come to you when it's time. Don't forget it.
when it's time, the answers was, will always come to you. Don't stop listening to people who don't know shit. Who wants to get clout and look important or for some shit that they can't even relate to, connect with. Trying to tell gifted people what gift is with no gifts. And maybe they had it one time, once upon a time ago, and they did wrong by it and it has, it has left them. It will be passed down to the next generation who deserves it. Living on fumes. Tell me about reconciliation. Reconciliation. Seven of Wands, undecided energy. Not knowing how to protect yourself or how to go about protecting yourself with the Seven of Wands. Aries, Leah, or Sag. Not knowing if you can trust this person or these people who want to reconcile with you because they might want your prosperity, your, um, your abundance, prosperity. They want what you got because they see that you are beautiful. They see that you have this light about you, this abundance about you, this prosperity about you. And if you don't trust them, don't do it. Cause that's, you're not sure. You're not sure. Tell me about the truth. Oops. That you are empress. That you are beautiful, that you have mastered many things. That means you had to do a lot of healing to be sitting in this chair, Empress, women. This is a feminine energy. You had to master many things. You had to face the truth within you in order to become a real you. In order to protect yourself from things that was not for you. You had to be honest with yourself about it. If I'm doing this to myself, it's because of me. I am lacking something within me. What is my problem? Once you start taking acknowledgement of what's wrong with you, you will understand why you keep gravitating to those people to harm you. They ain't doing it on purpose. They're doing what they know how to do. This is how they've been surviving. This is how they've been living. You just happened to walk upon them and they became your lesson too. You're not the only one they've done it to or do it to. Don't forget, they do it to themselves first. Tell me about prosperity. Tell me about this prosperity. This glow, this light, this completion, this com queen of cups in reverse. A negative, toxic women. You're going to be running into a lot of negative, toxic women. Claiming to be of love, claiming to know about love, and they are not. They are very manipulative when it comes to love. Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. Or somebody just have that heavy in their chart. Remember, we have the big five in the houses. So get to know who you are. But these women are manipulative. They will manipulate you off of your prosperity. It could be family members or friends. Don't get manipulated off of what's yours. You know who you can't trust. See them for who they are. And if you are lacking anything in any sort of form or fashion, they will take you and teach you a lesson. And you won't repeat it again. Tell me about talent. The secret is out. You are very talented in many things. Be okay with that. The secret is out with the moon card. How you raise your children, how you nurture yourself, how you protect yourself from people, places, and things, how you take care of your home. You are your home first. You've learned many things on this journey. Continue to do it. The more you learn, the more talented you will be, the more people will recognize you, and the more things you will see. You will see deception a mile away. Be okay with it. And stay away, right, away from confusing people. They are confused for a reason, and they will they will try to confuse you too. What else we need to know? Oh, three of wands in reverse. These people cannot make proper decisions. They will never choose themselves. They will always choose another because they are not themselves. They don't know who they are. They don't make good decisions. Make sure you pay attention to that. And they are looking for love in all the wrong places with the Ace of Cups in reverse. They don't have love to give. That's why they're looking for it so hard. Pay attention. Their cup has run empty. Nothing is running over. There's nothing in it. That's why they keep running to people to give them something. Poor decisions, like I said, when it comes to love. What else do we need to know? 
Do not celebrate with these people with your beautiful talents. They will use you and try to become you.